Good afternoon, everybody. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. And uh, good evening. Good morning. Depending on your geographical location. It's me, Tracy Dele at Tracy Dele's Kitchen for Fun. Today, I want to be preparing cow leg. The one the Nigeria people normally call unkwobi, cow leg spices, cow leg spices. So we Nigerians, we know these as unkwobi. So I have already cut the cow leg into small, small chunks, as you can see. And uh, beside, I have my blended crayfish already. And the next, I have my otazi leaf, dried otazi. Here, I have my calabash uh, nutmeg, known as ihu. Here, I have my two seasoning cubes. Beside, I have my scotch bonnet pepper. I have one red onions and one uh, yellow onions. I have my red oil. Here also, I have my uba. This is Africa salad. Mm? I have my uba. Mm? So, after preparing my mkwabi, I don't have um, fresh otazi. Since I already have the dried otazi, to garnish it up, I will be using my lettuce salad leaf. So, guys, we'll be getting started now. Lastly, I have my salt to taste. Let me just add the salt beside here. I have my salt to taste. So, that is the ingredients I will be using for my unkwabi this afternoon. Okay, guys. So, we'll be getting started now. Hey, it's my Ogba. Firstly, I will be putting on my heat. I'll be putting on my heat. I'll place my pots. Then I will have to add the cow leg. Now I'll be adding water. So be adding water. Then next, I want to take one of the seasoning cube. I'll be adding one of the seasoning cubes. As you see. Then next, I will take the yellow onions. I will chop the onions to boil the cowlick. With my seasoning cube so i've added the onions now i have to add salt to taste that is the onions so in here i have my onion my seasoning cube and the salt to taste so i'll have to cover it now to cook yes cow leg have need time to cook a bit not that soft but soft enough to chew so we have to leave it to cook for some minutes now now we have to check on the meat yo you see the cow leg is doing well <laughs> so you have to cook it to the stage that this uh, the the stock you are seeing here that is the this water it will have to go down a bit so we leave it to cook another few minutes so that the water will dry a bit then before that here is my two uh, scotch bonnets pepper i have chopped the two so i will add one to the boiling cow leg i preserve the other one for my sauce later Send it to it till it gives you the right texture. 
so that is it that is a calabar nutmeg i blended it together with the seasoning cube so i have to set aside also so let's quickly check on the meat we need some uh just some of the stock to miss our pepper sauce so i won't allow everything to get dried i think it's good to go now i have to put it off yes i have to put it off and uh, we have to extract the cow leg out from the stock now you see so that is the cow leg i have extracted it and here we have the stock so that is what we'll be using to prepare our sauce uh sorry guys i forgot to show you um if you all remember this is our otazi leaf it's very bitter eh? then uh, here i have my potash yes as we all know as cow so this potash i will have to uh i will have to use um, warm water for, to melt the potash so here is it so i've added water to the potash just added water to it I mashed the potash so that it will easily dissolve so. all right guys here is my uh, another fresh clean pot I will be using to mix the sauce here starts the game now firstly i will have to add my oil into the pot i'll have to add my oil into the pot so after adding the oil i will have to add the stock from the cow leg i boiled yes i will have to add that first then i will stir it together very well that is the stock i just added then after adding the stock i will have to add a bit of the uh, scotch bonnet pepper i chopped earlier remember we have a um, we boiled the meat with a uh, pepper some of the pepper so i'm adding just a half of the remaining one then i'll stir at this point you just have to add everything at a spot so i will be adding my otazi now I will have to strain the potash. I will have to sieve it. That is the potash. That is the cow, as we all know, cow. So that is the cow in the water. So I will have to sieve it because we, we don't want any. Uh, taste of sharpness like it will be tasting as if one added sand so that is it then I will stir now I just need that that orange color yes you see it's potash that will give you is cow may I call and cow moon I understand now cow will give you another orange color is potash that will give you this magic color you see so in there i have my otazi already my pepper and right away i want to be adding crayfish next the um calabar nutmeg that i blended along with uh my seasoning cube so i add it then i continue stirring I continue stirring, stirring. You see how thick it looks now? Continue stirring. 
you see how it looks and how thick it, it is you just have to stir it for everything the whole ingredients you added to incorporate very well then thereafter I want to be adding my uba yes sorry guys I'm too good <laughs> with this uba I can eat it raw just like this so after stirring for some time now the next thing I want to be doing is to add my uba you see that is it that is Africa salad so I add my uba then I stir 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 everything is off the heat now you see I added my uba, then I'll continue stirring. So after you have stirred, stir, 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 you see how pretty it looks. Now comes the time to add my um, cow leg. You see, I will have to add it bit by bit. I will have to add it bit by bit, then I will stir. Our kobe is already getting set to be saved you see i'll have to add it bit by bit till everything okay you see all right guys that is it so now our what i like doing is after this i will have to heat it on the on the on the gas for like uh just one minute that is it so that is our unkwobi it's ready mixed with uba africa salad here we go if you know your way to my house come and eat <laughs> ideally said if you know your way to my house but if you don't know your way to my house i'm sorry just feed your eyes so that is our unkwobi for today so I'll leave it to heat for like one minute, then I'll drop it. It's good to serve now. You see? All right, my people. It has heat for another one minute. I will have to bring it down now. Yes, so our own Kobe is ready. Here comes in my red onions and my lettuce. I have already sliced it. So I want to dress my ukwobi now so you see next now just have to take some out of the lectures you just place it like this you just place it here's the phone then you take the round the ring cut onions you just have to make sure you cut your onions into ring ring form here we go that is number one here we get the second serve so next i will have to take some of the lettuce as well you just dropped it firmly firmly then you go again and take the ring cut of the onions just that is our unkwabi for today i think i help someone to catch this phone also <laughs> all right my pretty people here is the final stage of our unkwabi today as you see mm, it's ready to go ready to go the, here beside is the second see also ready to go <laughs> all right guys love you all bye 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 bye